But we are starting with video you'll only see here on KHOU 11 News. A citizen jumps in and helps police take down a man with a gun. Dashcam video from the patrol car shows how this brave man supported the men in blue. And he talked exclusively with Kevin Reese, who was live on the west side with the story. Kevin? Yeah, you're about to watch that dash cam footage of a police chase through Hedwig Village, but at the end of this chase, it's the police officer who finds out he's not in this fight alone. Hedwig Police Officer Roy was on patrol near Bingle and Westview when the chase started. Going northbound, crossing underneath Westview. The pickup truck was stolen, the suspect weaving through traffic until he stopped at the intersection of Long Point, bailed out and let the truck keep rolling, and tried to escape on foot. We're going northbound. Northbound. The officer would catch the guy when he got tangled in a barbed wire fence. You can hear the struggle off camera. But he didn't catch him alone. He was a, a small stature, but he was putting up a pretty good fight. This is Nick Montalbano. He and his wife were at a restaurant nearby. That's him in the white shirt walking into the dash cam video. And the officer managed to get the cuffs on him. It, it was quite, a, quite, a, quite, a, quite an experience. <laughs> together, they wrestled the car thief to the ground and together found out the bad guy also had a gun, a Glock 26, in his waistband. And I was very grateful to have a citizen come and assist us because these are, these are bad times for police officers, as we all know. The first thing I did, we got, him, we got the guy handcuffed, is I shook his hand and said, thank you. I appreciate it. Nick Montalbano had also stopped the rolling pickup truck and brought the officer the truck keys to. Thank you, sir. Has put himself in harm's way over and over and over um, to help people, and he's very humble about it, um, but he's a great guy. These guys have a tough job and, and uh, kind of a thankless job at times, and they need help. You know, they're, they're people and they need help, and, and I'll do what I can to, to help them. I'm grateful because at the end of the day, were people too. People who have watched an entire community rally behind them after the murder of a Harris County deputy. A community now proving they're also willing to fight with them side by side. It turns out that pickup truck was stolen six weeks ago in Hockley. The owner of that truck was here today as well. It turns out the 19 year old who is now in the Harris County Jail was out on parole from Fort Bend County and he has also led police to at least three other stolen vehicles. Live in Hedwig Village, I'm Kevin Reese, KHOU 11 News.